The University of Missouri is known for its picture-perfect campus, its stadium-filling sports events, and its lively student body. The University of Missouri is also home to the world's first and oftentimes considered the world's finest journalism school. In 1908, the Columbia Herald's Walter Williams became the first dean of the journalism school. St. Louis Dispatch's Silas Bent and the St. Louis Republic's Charles G. Ross were among the first three newsmen to work as faculty. The education was intended to be a laboratory course in actual newspaper making that covered university news, local news, and major national and international news. The paper has undergone many name changes, but still prints to this day with Dean Walter Williams' intentions still in its core. As journalism evolved, journalism education did too. The Missouri School of Journalism now offers courses in strategic communications, documentary journalism, computer-assisted data reporting, and many other focuses. Competing schools like Northwestern and University of Wisconsin lack one thing that Missouri holds true. The Missouri method was developed in Walter Williams' classroom. This approach to learning has produced real-world results in hands-on multimedia trainings. Students in Mizzou's journalism school can work for the Missourian newspaper, at the NBC-affiliated TV station, the NPR-affiliate radio station, and many other options. This type of learning produced such successful results, all majors at the university integrated the Missouri Method education into their coursework. Although the university sits in high ranks for its prestigious journalism school, there are many critiques about the current state of journalism and journalism education. University of Missouri's own Catherine Reed was published in the Journal of Journalism and Mass Communication Educator, claiming that the world of journalism has been afflicted by the misinformation disorder and journalism students are not well equipped with the old school and cutting edge skills to rebuild trust in the news. The journal's recommendations suggest journalism education do more than just re-emphasize the importance of accuracy in journalism. Their recommendation is threefold. Teach students how to detect misinformation, teach students how to process information in a post-fact world, and teach students how to constructively interact with audiences that call for interactional versus transactional journalism. Mizzou and journalism schools alike must step up to the plate to create the next generation of credible journalists. With Mizzou's rich history and the faculty's love for the school, there is no doubt in my mind that Mizzou will be able to keep up. I came to the School of Journalism in 2004 because I liked this idea of combining teaching with actually continuing to do journalism.